Now, many college students today were only babies when those terrorist attacks took place. ABC 27's Micah Cho was on campus at Florida State University for a special ceremony. He explains how September 11th still impacts a new generation. <laughs> In an annual ceremony that honors the memory of the 2,977 victims of the 9-11 terrorist attacks, student organizers place a flag down on the Mina Joe Powell Green for every life lost that day. It's really a way for us as an FSU community to gather and reflect and remember the lives lost, as well as the sacrifices that our brave service members have made. Sarah Johnson with the Collegiate Veterans Association and Veteran Student Union at Florida State says the attacks affected her father's military service career. One of the reasons why she got involved with the association. I'm so very thankful for him and all of his fellow service members for the sacrifices they've made. And I'm thankful for all that they do for our nation and to keep us safe. Also in attendance at Saturday's ceremony, 20-year-old Tyler Roy, who was six months old on September 11, 2001. He says no matter your age when 9-11 happened, the attack will have a lasting impact on his generation and generations after. It became the world that we grew up in. It became how we viewed airports. It's weird because I know this is the world that I've only ever known. Megan McLaughlin was only two years old in 2001. She says coming to ceremonies like this humanizes that day. We slap labels on things. We attribute numbers to things, but we don't actually really think about the lives of the people behind those labels and those numbers. In Tallahassee, Micah Show for... In Tallahassee, Micah Cho, ABC 27.